Welcome to my little corner of the internet, where we celebrate creativity and growth. We're thrilled to present to you our video dedicated to Pananil Patel. Enjoy. Pananil Nanil Patel 7 May 1912 6 April 1989 was an Indian author known for his contributions in Gujarati literature. He wrote more than 20 short story collections, such as Sathi 1940 and Vatrak Nkauf 1952, and more than 20 social novels, such as Mulla Lajeev 1941, Manvini Bhave 1947 and Banjina Bear 1957, and several mythological novels. He received the Shnanpith Award in 1985. Some of his works were translated as well as adapted into plays and films. With our foundation established, it's time to explore life and its relevance to our overarching theme. He was born on 7 May 1912 in Mandi village now in Dungapa, Rajasthan to Nanisha aka Nanalal and Hiraba, an Anjana Chaudhari family. He is youngest among his four siblings. His father was a farmer and used to recite Ramayana, Okahain and other mythological stories for his village. This earned his house a nickname Abode of Learning. His father died during his childhood and his mother Hiraba raised the children. His education progressed with many difficulties due to poverty. He could study up to only the fourth standard at Sir Protop High School, Ida. During school days, he befriended his schoolmate Yumashenka Joshi. For a brief period, he worked as a manager in a liquor manufacturing company in Dungapa. He wrote his first novel while working as a domestic help in Omdabad, Gujarat. In 1936, he accidentally met his old friend Yumashenka Joshi who persuaded him to write. He wrote his first short story Shethni Shard in 1936. Later, his stories were published in many Gujarati magazines. In 1940, he received recognition for his first novel Valoman at the send-off, followed by Malala Jeev 1941, Manvini Bhave 1947 and many other novels. In 1971, he started a publishing company Sadhana in Omdabad along with his two sons. During the later years, he mostly wrote novels based on Hindu mythology and epics. He died on 6 April 1989 in Omdabad following brain haemorrhage. Brace yourself for an enlightening exploration of works as we dive into its profound implications. He wrote 61 novels, 26 short story collections and many other works. He wrote his works mostly in the native idioms of Sabarkant, the district in North Gujarat. Love has been central theme of his many novels. He depicted in his works the rural life of Gujarat artificially. His novels are centered around the village, its people their lives, hopes and aspirations, their problems and predicaments. Mullah Lajeev 1941, a story of unfulfilled love between Kenji and Jivi having been born in different castes, is considered as one of his best novels. His novel Manvini Bhave 1947 is rated as most powerful portrayal of Gujarat's rural life and the exploration of rural life during the early years. His novel Narshuk 1955 is based on Satyagraha movements of Mahatma Gandhi and it enumerates Gandhi's various endeavors for freedom of India and spiritual uplifting of Indian people. His other novels depicting rural life are Banjina Bear 1957, Kamavalan Vol. 1 to 1968, Fekiro 1955, Mankavata 1961, Karolian Uyolu 1963. Mean Matinamanji 1966, Kank 1970, Ijavali Ratamasi 1971. His novels depicting urban life are less entertaining than rural life. Biru Safi 1943 was his first novel. His other novels depicting urban life are Yovan Vol. 1 to 1944, Pada and Padchea 1960, Aimbi Vol. 1 to 1962. And the Ashidni 1964, Pranayana Jujapot 1969, Alad Kokori 1972, Ek Onoki Preet 1972, Nathi Parnia Nathi Kumra 1974, Raw Material 1983. Galsing 1972 is historical novel of love and valor. His novels, other than theme of love, are Pakhalbara 1947, 
Valley Vatima 1966, Echo 1973, Te 1979, Hegel 1981. Angaro 1981 is his detective novel. Han Vation of Narsin Meta and Jean Jidi Jamu 1984 are his biographical novels of Narsin Meta and Ravi Shankar Mahara respectively. Nagab Narayan 1967 and Marketal 1973 are his humorous novels. During his later years, he wrote stories based on characters of epics, Mahabharata and Ramayana, and Puranas and other Hindu mythological stories. He preserved the original story and its miraculous themes but gave new meanings at several instances. His such works include Path Nekaho Chadav Banvol. 1 5 1974, Rame Seton Mojo. Vol. 1 4 1976, Krishna Jivan Leela Vol. 1 5 1977, Shiva Parvati Vol. 1 6 1979, Bishmani Banshi Vol. 1 3 1980, Catch Dedini 1981, Dedini Yeti Vol. 1 2 1982, Satyva Manomanushi Pranay in 1984. Manavya Kanivrati 1984, Mahabharatano Pratham Pranay Beam Hidimba 1984, Arjuna Vendas Pranipravas 1984, Pradyama Prabhavati 1984, Sri Krishna Alf Patranio 1984, Shikhani Streak Purush 1984, Revatigala Balduji 1984, Sadhu Banu Matino Pranay 1984, Kabya and Sri Krishna 1984, Naman Nari Ilan 1986, Amalak Ritual Nasar Jeevan of Ashipurava 1986. He wrote more than 450 short stories. His short story collections are Sukhdafna Sathi 1940, Jindajanakal 1941, Jeevodan 1941, Makwasi 1944, Hantanarang 1946, Ajubmanavi 1947, Satchish Shamanan 1949, Vatratan 1952, Rotten 1954, Haravada 1956, Manamora 1958, Tavovo Guntado 1958, Telotaman 1960, Dilnivot 1962, Harti Ebnishita 1962, Tiaji Anarosh 1963, Dilaso 1964, Chitali Duolo 1965, Morlin Amungasa 1966, Molo 1967, Batno Teko 1969, Onwa 1970, Koi Deshi Koi Parveshi 1971, Asmani Nila 1972, Bini 1973, Shinako 1975, Ganugad 1979 and Nato 1981. Jamera 1952 is collection of one act plays. Polia Sag Sisam in 1963 and Bain Narsayo 1977 are his original three act plays. Kankan 1968 and Lidkokari 1971 are play adaptations of his novels Fakiro and Lidkokari respectively. Shandoshen Shamalo 1960, Sapanan Sathi 1967 and Kanan Ogujarati adaptations of Western plays. Swapna 1978 is an adaptation of a story by Aurobindo. He also wrote children's literature. Vatikilal Vol. 1 to 1972, 1973, Balkilal Vol. 110 1972, Rishikal Nikatha Vol. 1 for 1973, Devno Diddle Vol. 15 1975, Mahobarit Kishaka for 1976, Ramayan Kishaka for 1980, Sri Krishna Kishaka for 1980, Setu Unikatha Vol. 15 1981 are his works for children and teens. Alapalup 1973 is his autobiographical work depicting his childhood and teenage years. Panalani Shreshk Vata 1958, Hanalano Vata Vabe of 1963, Vaini Navaliko 1973, Hernayana Akaman 1978, Lokanjin 1984 are his edited and selected works collections. His other works are Olakmaluk 1986 and Sarjani Suvarna Smarnika 1986. Jindiji Sanjeevani Vol is his autobiography. With our foundation established, 
it's time to explore translations and adaptations and its relevance to our overarching theme. Malala Jeev has been translated in several Indian languages such as Punjabi, Canada and as Kalasina Jeevathalu in Telugu by Vemuri and Janiya Sama. The novel was translated by Rajesh I. Patel into English as The United Souls in 2011. Manvini Bhave is translated in English by Vyvikantik as Endurance, a droll saga 1995, published by Saitya Academy. His novels were Lajeev, Manvini Bhave and the short story Kanku were adapted into films. Mulajeev is adapted into films and plays several times. Alajan directed by North. Aicharya was the first Gujarati film adaptation of novel. Malala Jeev 1956 is a Gujarati film directed by Manha Raskapa while Kanku 1969 was directed by Kantilal Rafford. Both films were scripted by Patel himself. Janumana Jodi, 1996 Indian Canada film, is based on Malala Jeev. It was also adapted into a Gujarati play, directed by Naimsh Desai. Brace yourself for an in-depth analysis as we navigate through recognition and its far-reaching implications. He received Ranjitram Suvarna Chandrak in 1950 and Shnampath Award in 1985. He was the second writer from Gujarati language after Yumashenka Joshi in 1967 to receive the Shnampath Award. In 1986, he received Satya Gaurav Puraska. Have any questions or topics you'd like me to cover in future videos? Let me know in the comments.